this happened, because this is about to happen, because we bought this. We are Maggie, James and Melissa. It is packing the shed day today, the dreaded packing. So, let's make our way to the shed and get started. Okay, before we do anything else, let's go and get a cup of tea. I've got to get to the cup of tea first though. Oh, no water. have to go and get some water. I don't have plumbing in the shed. I have provisions for plumbing, but I've never had it installed. So I've got to go and get some water. Uh, change the leads, coffee, tea. Alright, now I can have a cup of tea. So I've got my cuppa and I realised that this is Friday and in two Fridays time we'll be leaving, we'll be driving down to Tasmania. Ooh, it's getting close, but I've got to get this shed done. I'm not looking forward to it. I'm going to have my cuppa Put you on time lapse and get this done. First, I already get my hair out of my face. All right, let's get this done. I think it's a uh, cup of tea time and uh, have a break for a little bit. Cup of tea done, put the laundry out, did some forms. Now we better finish what we started. Here we go. <laughs> Thank you. 
Okay, another hour down, and I think I've done as much as I can possibly do. Um, all this that you can see, I don't know, all that over there is for candle making. I've got a market on Saturday, and I've got a market next Saturday as well. So I market tomorrow, and market next Saturday, so therefore I still need them to make candles because hopefully I sell a lot and then I've got underneath here uh, you'll see that I've got wax and I've got all my jars I've got some more jars over the other side as well so I can't move them or pack them um, there are odds and sods that I don't know how to pack so for example uh, my spinning wheel down here. I don't know how to pack that. And okay, so down here is my other spinning wheel, and they're just too big for the boxes. And I don't know how to pack them. And I'm not sure if I might have to get something from Bunnings or something like that to uh, to put them in. I have no idea. They were a bit iffy about it. Um, so I'm thinking use that cloth wrap it around, stick it around. I mean, they're going to wrap this up in plastic um, and put blankets and everything over it. So I don't see why they can't do the same for my two wheels. Um, but everything else, um, so I can't, as I said, I can't touch any of that because I need to use it over the next two weeks. Um, but once I've done that, they can go in a box. They're already boxed up there, okay? A lot of that I'm actually taking um, that one there and that one there are coming in the car with me. Um, but I think, I think we're done. I don't know about keeping the baskets because apparently I have to put them in a box as well. <laughs> so yeah we'll see but um there's quite a bit of stuff over there but uh, i think i've done a, a pretty good job today all right let's uh let's see what we're going to be doing next Everybody gets really excited when we go to the markets. Gotta get your collar. our second last market for far north Queensland. This is our trailer which we pull by my big fancy car. Maggie's already in there. She's I don't know, black on black, very hard to see. But there she is. Hello Maggie Moore. in the morning. Oh.
off to the market and this is where Maggie sits. Hey, snuggly. See you at the market. Just sunrise this morning, which is unusual for Melanda markets, as we always seem to get rain. So our last market here in Melanda. Gorgeous day. Alright, we have arrived and now it is time to set up the market. I'm going to put you on time lapse and let's go from there. So, it is the next day after the markets, we had a reasonable market and I have to now make candles. I've got my cup of tea in hand and uh, let's start making candles.
Okay, so we're all set up and uh, now all I need to do is wait for the wax to melt. I'm gonna have another cuppa, might take an hour or two. Let's have a look at how it's going. Okay, so this is my U Butte wax melter. Absolutely love this thing. However, it only, well, it says it does seven liters, but actually it's probably only about five if I'm lucky. I am going to upgrade to the biggest one that they sell, but I'll wait until I get to Tassie for that. So let's see how we're going with the wax. Still got a little bit to go. And I have a funny feeling with the amount of candles I have to make. Um, so I've had an order of 12 tins. I am doing these pretty ones here as goodbye presents for all my friends. So friends, if you see this, you saw your candle be made. Um, and I've got some tea lights to make because they ran out. I do 10 different tea light fragrances, but I only fill them up when they're empty. And uh, yeah, so let's wait for that wax melter to melt the wax, have a cup of tea, and, uh, and then we'll make the candles. All right, let's check this wax melter, see if the wax is all done. Oh yeah, look at that. Okay, let's put you back on time lapse and let's get this pulled. And tomorrow I will finish them off, pack them up, and that's another day candle making done. It is Monday morning and we're off to run around all over Cairns to get all the last things we need for our big trip. We're looking at things like I need to get a new phone, uh, I've got to get the car electrics done so it's 7.30 in the morning and I've got to drop that off. I've got my breast screen. Don't worry, I'm not going to fill that. Walkie-talkie, thermals, clothes, shower tent to go on the back of the um, car because we're going to be on the road for five weeks. And some places you need your porta potty, so let's make it private. Car fridge, boxes for my wheels. Oh, let's get going. Getting into Aztec because we're getting the walkie-talkie shopping center let's see if we can get a phone and some seat covers for seat covers anaconda for thermals and camping stuff and now it's breast screening time yay boobs done quick and easy takes five minutes totally worth it women get it done men think about it yourselves because you get breast cancer too Alrighty, home time. Pick up the car, we're off home. Picked up my car, used Auto Sparks to get the electrics done on my car because the trailer indicator light wasn't working and they've done a brilliant job. So great. If you're ever in Cairns, totally recommend these guys. Okay, it's time to go home. Time to take Puppy for a walk. And I also got myself a new microphone. So let's see how that has worked and if uh, this recording is better. It's also on my brand new camera, which is supposed to have much better recording facilities, good for vlogging. So let's see how we go. So this is the park across the road. It is a footy field. 
They have uh, rugby here often, big competition. Uh, they do karate or judo or whatever they do in there. And our home is there. And that's the pyramid. And she's off. So Maggie Moo's already made it to the gate. She knows she gets a treat when she is there. Good girl. Good girly. live at the moment you have the pyramid there and the mountains behind and then you can go up these hills to the tablelands there is a golf course just there with the race course in front and they will eventually be making this into a whole sporting precinct James is doing his food safety course. First unit halfway done. Another unit to go. Can you see the excitement? The end of the week. Cup of tea. And I need to get this video finished and up. Next week, last week here at our house in North Queensland. Yeah, it's a bit, uh, bit scary, bit full on, bit exciting, very exciting, really exciting. Oh, by the way, James did finish his uh, food safety course. Of course he did, he had the best trainer. So, uh, yeah, uh, I think that's pretty much all we've done this week, which has been a full on week, and next week will probably be even more, and then we are on the road. Alright, so I'm going to leave it there. Take care everybody. Remember to do all the good stuff. Like, subscribe, share, comment. And uh, we'll see you next week. Alright everyone, take care.